We gotta do something about Jay. What do you mean? We gotta do something about Jay. He's gotta go. He's in witness protection, Janine. You know what witness protection means. Here's the address of where he's staying. Get in the car. You really want to go down this path? We're still working on this. Where did you get this? I've been around a long time, sweetie. Jay's turned. And he's not coming back. Even if the boys get off, I won't be seeing Jay again. And I don't want Darren to rot in that jail. If my boys go down, that's it. I've got no one left. Jay's gone. Whatever happens. We've got to set up a meeting. Is your office safe? Look, I know you got a problem, Janine. But I don't see how this mess you boys are in has got anything to do with me. So if you've called me in here to see if there's some strings I can pull in your way, of course. Is that what this is about? Hey, Randall. Before you go on, this boy who's currently being looked after... Tell me if you agree with this. This boy who's being looked after... He knows who you are. And you know how these things go. They're going to ask him all sorts of questions about everything he's ever seen or done. Everyone he's ever met. The whole schmozzle. And you've done some bad things, sweetie. Haven't you? I want this part to be clear. This is not about you doing me a favour or... me blackmailing you, anything like that. It's just a bad situation for everyone. Ezra's got the address. It shouldn't be too hard to set up a raid on the house. There'd be reasonable grounds, what with all the strange activity, the comings and goings day and night. One of the neighbours might have seen a gun or something. This is your area of expertise. I'm not trying to tell you how to suck eggs. What do you think? I really don't see how anything can be done, Janine. Randall. I feel sick about this. I'm not happy at all. Not one little bit. But we do what we have to do. We do what we must. Just because we don't want to do something doesn't mean it can't be done. 